Hello, 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 Zooey Mama is back and today we've got a great little tutorial as always. I always say that, don't I? It's, they're always great little tutorials. But anyway, let's get on to it. Well, I'm saying that, wait until we finally actually get there because we've got so many builds now, it's getting ridiculous and it's taking a long time to get there. And as you can see, my computer is trying to render in as well, which is a bit of a nightmare. But anyway, here we go. This is what I've been working for. And this is what people have been asking for. It is the stray. Look at that guy. I, I tell you what, I'm not going to lie. I did actually struggle quite a bit with this guy. So um, bear with me. Uh-oh, and the creeper is coming to attack us. Run, everyone, run! Ah! Oh, okay. Just make sure you subscribe and it won't happen again promise <laughs> anyway um so yeah anyway so yeah look at this um we i suppose we better sort of get onto the build then really because uh i think it's about that sort of time actually let's get onto the colors first because that's always a good place to start and hopefully we won't miss any off this time so we have gray concrete uh cyan terracotta like Grey concrete, light grey wool, stone, a little bit of that, clay, white concrete, light blue concrete, and cyan concrete. And they are all the colours you'll be needing. Now let's get on to the build. So what we're going to do is do a little four square, and we're going to go up by one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, like so. Okay, da -da 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 -da. and all you're going to do is fill all this in. Da -da -da, a little bit of a time lapse here. I should have sped this up a little bit, shouldn't I? But anyway, you get the, you get the picture. A little a little box, and then we're going to come across by two, and then place on that one there. So a two block gap, and we're going to do the same again, and we're going to go up to the same level. Okay, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. If I can count right, yeah. Oh oh, what am I doing? Uh, too much. <laughs> there we go. We we'll just fill this bit in there as well, and that's it. That's it. The last legs done. Believe it or not, really easy. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to go up by four, as you can see. On, on, the, on that fourth block there, we're going to place this pattern, okay? So, um, make sure, obviously, you can see, I'll, I'll pan around in a minute, it is actually overhanging the legs by one either side, so as you can see. So, make sure you go up by three, start on the fourth one, and whack on this pattern as always, okay? So, you're, you're not, there we go, yeah, yeah, there you go, look. See what I mean? Overhanging by one. Once you've done that, we're going to go around to the back and we're going to start from that block again, the fourth block up, like so. And we're going to do it from the both. So there you go. I'll mark it at both since it's about easier if you And again, we're doing a pattern. It's a little bit different than the, than the front side, but um, yeah, nevertheless, <laughs> make sure you copy that down and obviously pause it. Yeah, um, all right, okay, here we go. So we're going to do the sides. I don't know what I'm doing here. I'm just having a little look around. <laughs> the thing is, like I always say, I do the voice after I did the actual video. So um, <laughs> sometimes I get a bit confused myself. But anyway, once you've done that, <laughs> had a little look around like I did, we're going to go and see this pink section here. This is what we're filling in now. And we're doing it from that point onwards, all right? So there we go. You should have... One, two, three, four, five, six blocks that is high from, from where I paste the pink, all right? So make sure you leave a four block gap there from the bottom. Oh, don't take out the leg like I did. And <laughs> what you're gonna do is you're gonna spin on round and we're pretty much gonna do the same again. So we're gonna start with start from that bit there, as you see, and we are putting on this pattern there. Whoosh. And you should have some it looking a little bit like that. And so far, we have done the leg sections. So congratulations, you've built yourself a stray leg. <laughs> a stray leg. I don't know if that was a joke, but it sounded good. Okay, so here we go. So now we're going to start on the torso part of the build. And we're building across this section here. I'm just sort of marking out so you don't get a bit confused. And we're going to put on this pattern there. Woohoo! And so, see, you see a, a lot of pink there. So you can ignore them or you can leave them blank or, or whatever you want. Put a block there if, that you don't need. I've just put it there purely just to make it a bit easier on this build because there's a lot of gaps, as you can imagine, because the, wi the, the wither, why did I say the wither? The stray does have a lot of like. Um, sort of like bits of fabric, let's say, hanging down, and it does get a bit confusing if you can't see where you're where you're building. So I just sort of put the pinks there, and um, just then it doesn't confuse you because obviously when we take them out in a minute, you'll see what I mean because now you can see right through to the other side, and you might get confused, 
and might be placing blocks where you shouldn't be. So once you've done that, we're going to obviously knock out any blocks that you had in there previously. I mean, if you did it with no blocks and you just went ahead and built it, congratulations, because you're a way better builder than me. I struggled so much um, <laughs> with this. I think it was just all the gaps that was in there and it was just confusing. And another thing that really confused me, and it doesn't take much, believe me, is the, the colors. Because obviously there's only so many colors that you've got in Minecraft and trying to build this stray... Um, um, close to the actual the mob itself um, these colors I've used are slightly different obviously because we ain't got all the the color palettes available but let me just get to this point this point because it's important that you count this up so we're gonna do like a little square and it's one away from the body and we're gonna go up by one two three four five six seven eight like that okay so one block away from the the side of the hip there as you sin and we're going to go up by eight. Okay, so make sure you get that because it's very important that we get this in the right place because it's going to make the whole body ski whiffed. Okay, and we're going to go back to this side and we're going to come one block away from the base of that um, uh, clay con clay concrete that we've used. I mean clay that we've used. It's not clay concrete. It's just clay. And then we're going to go up again by the same amount. So it's eight. Okay. Oh God, sometimes I just need to remember to breathe as well because I'm just going to hyperventilate and collapse. <laughs> right, so you should have two floating arms looking a little bit like this. And now we're going to go back to my pink, which I love I love using because it's just easy to show you where, we, where we're building from. So we're going to start from this point here, and I believe that was five blocks up. And we're going to put on this pattern here. And it should eventually come to the top of the build, okay? the top of the shoulder should I say so we can knock out the pink because we don't need that again look at that looking beautiful looking beautiful and we're gonna go from the other side and do the same again so we're gonna go one two three four and on that fifth block we are gonna place this pattern there we go and again just take out the colors or don't put any colors like I did just get out that pink cool you are doing a fantastic job by now. Hopefully, you've got something looking a little bit like this, and I hope you have. And we're going to swing on around to the back, and we're just going to finish off the back of the arms, and then we're pretty much good. So we're going to go across from that grey block there, as I just pointed to here, and you're going to overhang by one, okay? So from the bottom, it's actually five up, but we're going slightly across, and we're starting from that block there, okay? And again, ignore the pink. So this part, again, should sort of come flush with the top of the build, top of the shoulders, and it all should be lining up lovely by now. There we go. And we're going to do the same on the other side, exactly the same. So we can either come up by four from the bottom, or by five, should I say, and then across by one. Or you can obviously just follow that grey block right across and start from there. Or you can start from the top. It's entirely up to you how you do it. I don't, I don't mind. We're just over halfway now of completing the actual build. So once you've done that, obviously knock out the colour that you didn't have there or you had there. You don't need it anymore. But you should have something looking like that. It looks like a bit like a cape, I think. A bit like Batman or a bat. I don't know. It just it does look pretty cool. Um, <laughs> so anyway, we're going to go spin on around to the side now. And we're going to start building this side. up. And for once, I'm not actually going to be lazy. I'm actually going to build it in front of you. Here we go, look. See a little bit of building magic in the making. So we want to go up by three with this one, up by one, two, three again, come across. So you're doing like two L's basically, L is upside down and a bit of grey wall in between. So there we go. Gives it that nice little fray look again. And all we're going to do is go replicate that on the other side. So we're going to spin on round and we're going to start off from this section here next to that um, cyan, come down by two. And then come up by three, do an upside down L, like so. And then go up again and do the same there. And then fill in the other bits with wool. I've actually tried to slow down with my builds. I don't know if you've noticed because um, a few people were sort of saying that I go too quick. So I have actually tried to slow my videos down quite a lot. Just so it just makes it a little bit easier for you to obviously actually build them. Because, uh, yeah, I didn't realize it until you watch it back afterwards that, I do actually go quite quick sometimes, so I do apologize for that. And to finish off the arms, all we're going to do is put a bit of wool across it, like so, and then just put a little bit of 
terracotta there and concrete just to finish it off look at that all we need to do now is build the head right so now onto the head so what we're going to do is start from this wall section here and don't worry about the stone that i'm using because that's just a random block i happen to have them at <laughs> god have them hand at the same time and we're going to go across by eight so you should be overhanging the edges by two either side and whoa we're going to whack on that pattern there look at that looking cool and you've guessed it, we're going to be going on to the next side. So we're starting across this wool section here. I keep saying wool, weird, really weird wool section here. And guess what? Build battle. Build battle. So we're on to the build battle. So test your might against me. So all you need to do is build the one half like I have and then try and beat me while we're building at the same time, building the second half. So go. Go, 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 go. This is quite easy, this one. Well, I say that. I'm really slow at this one. I reckon you're probably going to beat me. If you've been doing the other build battles and you managed to beat me, congratulations. But I think this one I'm really slow at. And I'm placing wrong blocks as well. Look at this. And I haven't actually... I didn't actually, literally, I recorded this and um, I didn't do any retakes, so I literally done it the first time round, um, as of you probably might be doing it at the same time as well. So this is legit me doing it um, <laughs> without doing sort of any edits, and I'm so slow, really poor. I'll try to give you a bit of a chance because obviously, if I'm doing it several times over, it's easy for me to sort of get the patterns right and obviously sort of cheat a little bit. So I decided to obviously just go straight at it without editing it and just obviously record it and then obviously show you. You the raw footage so this is it um, and yeah as you can see I'm not doing too great I'm actually quite slow I think I think <laughs> to be honest you're probably gonna beat me so you know what you got to do so all you need to do is build the first half like I did and then obviously we're gonna have a race and um, to build this second half of the head and yeah it's not looking great for me I don't think I reckon you've probably beat me you definitely I, I don't know hands down I think you've beaten me this time around you might have won, won this match but Next one, I think I've got you in the bag. I've got it. Yeah, I've, I've, I've given up on this one. I, I just, that was slow. Jeez, that was really slow. But anyway, let's have a little look and see the difference. I think we've got it spot on as well. Look, I didn't make any, any mistakes there, which is good. But obviously, it was just really slow. So let me know how you got on if you managed to beat me in that little build battle. Anyway, let's get on to the next part of the build. And we're going to do the head, or the face, should I say, like so... And then we're going to spin on around and then do the back end of the head. And then we've got one more panel to go, and that is it, guys. We're done. So there you go. Back of the head. And remember to pause it. And looking cool. I just realized as well, we need to fill in a bit of... Um, uh, I keep saying concrete, it isn't it? It's clay across the bottom there, just to finish off the head. And we're also going to go to the front and do the same with that part there like so and that will just give it tidy it all off and then all we're going to do now is spin on to the top of the head and just put the last panel on and that is it congratulations you've now finished the I need I nearly said wither again it isn't the wither it's the stray <laughs> there we go the strain all of its glory it took me an absolute forever well it felt like forever to build it but there we go it looks pretty cool from a distance i don't really like it up close but that's just me <laughs> anyway i've been zooey mama i hope you enjoyed the build make sure you subscribe and uh yeah stick around for the next one because i've got another tutorial coming very soon and shortly and i've got a few little different ideas coming up for future builds so i'll see you later bye